So, it's day after Pride, just kind of thinking back on yesterday. A lot of fun. A lot of fun. If you didn't see it, which I don't know how you didn't if you're following me, but um, go to yesterday's vlog, check it out. Um, I actually had two parts on that vlog. Um, the beginning portion I actually recorded the week before, and then the latter stuff I all recorded yesterday. So, but yeah, had a lot of fun marching in the parade with the Metro Transit bus. Good times. Hung out with a bunch of friends from all over. A um, couple other drivers were there um, that we all hung out and had a great time. And just uh, kind of made a whole day of it. It was a lot of fun. Uh, last night wrapped up with some great, great barbecue with my partner um, and a good friend of ours. Uh, yeah, and just, just had fun. It was it was a lot of fun. Um, so yeah, now I know a little bit more about me and about my life. Um, and like I said, don't want to piss anyone off and I don't don't ever intend and don't want to hurt anyone. Just figured you guys should know that this is me. This is who I am. Driver 69047. When it comes to driving bus, please don't call it in. Please don't call it in. Um, unless you have something nice to say, that'd be awesome. Um, and just, this, this is me. I am Mark. Or as I put in my, I think, credits yesterday, Cub. Because that's what. I guess there's some overtime or something. That's what that stands for. It's the Bear Pride flag. So. Oh well, I better see what this message is. So, I will see you later. Just getting ready to head out on 18 and 554. Got 10 minutes till I pull out. Got my pre trip all done. Watching the football go through its cycles, and when I mean the football, I mean the go-to part of the river. So, yeah. Just got a couple trips on 18, one trip on the 554, come back north again on the 18, and then I am done. Tuesday, Wednesday off. I thought about doing some OT, but I don't know if I will or if I will. I probably won't do any of those things. Yeah. Looks like the bus in front of me is just pulling away. And now I'm gonna move up at least, so. Well, it got really, really nice, sunny, and bright out. It's still a little windy, but it's nice. A lot better than what it was over this weekend. So. Just started up 18 line. Head south, come back north. Double over to 554. Then head south for that. Head north, and then done. And then it is my weekend. After I just said yesterday off, I know. But yesterday I got paid because I took it as a vacation day. So. Yeah, yawned again. You know. Someone should keep a running tally of how many times I yawn in all my vlogs when I'm on camera. Ugh, oh, it's annoying. So, yep. Not too much else to really talk about. I mean, I don't want to try to go out of my way to make something seem exciting and cool, but I don't know, it kind of seems a little meh. Just talking and running out of stuff to say and just killing time. So, rather than bore you to death with tears or, or bore you to tears or however the thing goes, I'll just do this. So, one little thing that kind of can get annoying um, would be when passengers get, I guess, upset uh, when we're at a time point. 
and they expect us to be like taxis and get them from point A to point B as fast and as quick and as possible. Um, if you wanted a taxi, get a taxi. And if you wanted to get from point A to point B in a rather quick amount of time, buses usually can do it, but if we're ahead of schedule, we have to stop at our time points. Just saying. So, yeah. Had a customer almost like have a conniption fit, I guess, about it when I was sitting at Franklin and Nicollet waiting out my time because I got there early. Because like, I don't know why it takes so long, like, it takes like five minutes to get from to like Nicollet and Franklin. I'm like, I was going to turn around and point blank and say, well, you know what? If you wanted a taxi, take one. The bus does not work that way. We are on a time schedule. We need to be at certain points at certain times. If I leave early, I get in trouble and people miss their connections. But I didn't. I just kept my mouth shut. The guy got off on 26th and Nicollet. And he said, like, I should have just, I could have just walked it. And, um, again, I didn't say anything. I could have said, well, then you probably should have. But I didn't. So, and then like he gave me like this like weird look when I passed him mid-block, I'm like, yeah, that's not a time point. That was a time point back there, so whatever. It's like, get over yourself. If you think you're all that and then some, then pay for the taxi. Don't just pay the, I don't even know if he paid like a full fare. I think he did. But it's like, really? Public transit doesn't, it, it works and it gets you from point A to point B. Is it going to get there exactly when you want it to get there? Chances are pretty slim on that one. Sorry. So. Oh well. I guess that's the annoying person of the day. I don't know. Or just the person who's like, get over yourself. Whatever. What? It is my weekend. Officially my weekend. So. Yeah, I already changed out of my uniform and into my kilt, one of my kilts. I wore a kilt yesterday, by the way. I don't know if you saw it really or not, but whatever. But, um, yeah. Again, I had a lot of fun yesterday, and uh, now you guys, again, know one more thing about me. And, uh, yeah, I guess I'm just gonna wrap it up by saying peace. See you tomorrow. Have a good night. Bye.